I'm here with the 2021 M1000RR and today we're gonna be talking ignition coils. So this seems to be an issue on the 2020 plus BMW S1000 and M1000RR where the ignition coils can go out suddenly where the bike starts sounding like a WRX uh, or starts sounding like, like an R1, it's down on power. Um, these can be all symptoms of an ignition, ignition coil that's gone bad. I always keep one of these with me, I actually have two of them, but being at $200 a piece, um, that may not be feasible for some people. Uh, just for an emergency, just in case I need to get the bike out in the street or I need to go to an event or something and this coil, you know, maybe on backward or something like that. So I make sure I have two of these at least. So if you have these symptoms, the easiest way to diagnose this, most people would say, pull the tank off, pull the air box off, pull the wiring harness off, pull the injectors out, and then get to the coil itself, pull it out, and then of course take a multimeter and check the continuity between here and down here. And if it's running good, then cool, that one's good. Go to the next one. Um, yeah, that takes a little bit of time to do. So the easiest way that we found to do it here is gonna be the infrared thermal meter right here. So basically what we do here is we take this and if a cylinder's running, of course, it's gonna be hot. Now I have, let me see here, you can see like a little dot right there, right? I've ran this for a second or whatever, and it's 93 degrees right now in this cylinder. And you're just firing at the primary basically. So in there, I'm firing it right there. And you wanna make sure they're all kind of at the same, um, same height or from the primary. So right there, I got one right over there. You can see that one's a little bit hotter because it's uh, covered by the other two cylinders next to it and the engine and everything else. So it's gonna run a little bit hotter. Basically you're looking for something that is dramatically colder. So out of the four cylinders we have here, the coldest one that's gonna be dramatically colder um, is gonna be what we call the, the, the dead hole. So when you pull the bike apart, you'll know exactly which one is going to be, or likely going to have to be changed out. This just kind of gives you a good idea of if it's, if it's an ignition coil or not, if the bike's sounding bad or something like that. So this really does help. It just tells you if the cylinder is down or not. Now, of course, it doesn't absolutely mean it's a coil. It could be a spark plug itself. It could be a multitude of other things, but with the issues the S1000RR is having, um, it's likely that it's an ignition coil. And just to give you an idea here, this, this piece right here, I can measure pretty much anything. So that's 94 degrees. If I go over here, check the exhaust on the Ducati that hasn't ran, 78 degrees. So it's a really useful tool to have. And if you have these issues, of course, um, you're gonna wanna get a new coil. You can go get one at your dealer. Do not get some weird wonky one off Amazon or eBay. Just go to the dealer and get one. It's a proper piece. Um, most of the time, if you go to the dealer and the bike's still under warranty, uh, the dealer will swap these out. Um, I haven't, I've only seen a couple rare instances where the dealer kind of got some pushback and was like, no, we're not gonna swap them out. Um, they should be swapping these out because this is a warranted item right here. And that's it guys, that's today's tech tip.